Welcome back everyone, Hyman here, and we got another episode of Banished for you. Uh, let's see, last time we were able to expand our city, or our town, or whatever it is supposed to be called right now, uh, this way, and at the end of the episode, I placed down these uh, blacksmith and the tailor, because we are running low on our uh, tools and clothing. So I added some more builders just then to hopefully uh, get that done before we run out of either of those two things. And just doing a quick little check. Uh, we have a lot of food. They, I guess two of them are able now to keep up with our firewood supply. Uh, this uh, forestry lodge seems to be able to keep up with that demand right now. Uh, it's probably going to get uh, start going down after we put in uh, the blacksmith because whenever he makes tools he needs wood so uh, I'll probably have to look into setting up a new one or cutting down some more forest. Uh, looks like the only thing that we're missing right now is stone so let's see let's keep the time slow and uh, so you gather any stone from right there right there right there and over here try to try to get our stone supply back up so that we can actually continue building things and let's speed up the time so we can actually get these two done. Almost there. Both up 70. You're pulling ahead of him. Come on, guys. You're almost there. You're getting really close. You're on the home stretch. Get this tail and the blacksmith done so I can do stuff. I'm pretty sure these buildings only take one guy as well, so that's that's also really nice about them. Uh, I can go and put a tailor in there so he can start making clothing. And now I can put a blacksmith. And he'll go ahead and make some iron tools. Uh, you have in these these two locations you have a standard which is this iron tool but if you build a mine and you get coal or trade for coal you can actually make steel two tools and they'll uh, last a little bit longer uh, same with this guy his standard uh, crafting is just a hide coat made of leather uh, if you have sheeps like we do we could make a wool coat out of the wool and if you have a supply of both, you can actually do a combination of a warm coat, which is, uh, I think it's a little bit more durable than both of these, and I think it also keeps you warmer, possibly. It's been a while since I actually looked at the, the stats and stuff for that, so I might be wrong in that. Uh, it might have gotten updated, uh, so sorry for any misinformation, but hopefully... Uh, I know, I know, I'm pretty sure that it's it's more durable. So. so let's see here. What else do we have? Uh, oh, wow! Uh, this guy is on the ball. Remember, we had nine, and he's already produced nine for us. So this Taylor is is he is on the ball, and he is making stuff. So let's see here, uh, we're pretty good for food right now, so I'm not going to look into building any farms or, or uh, what are they called, orchards? Is that what's the thing called? Crop field orchard, yeah. Uh, but those are the, like, the next large scale, uh, food production things. Uh, I 
could go fisherman, but that's also uh, it's, it takes up four people, or it, I think it maxes out at four people that can be at the location, and I probably would be able to max it out because we only have five available laborers, so probably not going to go with that. Um, so yeah, the other professions I don't think we really need or have any use for right now, so probably going to just hang tight for a bit and, and let the village grow up a little bit, uh, consider about uh, building more houses over here. I guess I could actually go ahead and lay out some, some roads, put some people on building those. I can go and build two more houses out there, and uh, where's the road going to go? Right there. Cool. Uh, put two more people on that. Oh, did we get another laborer? Oh, we got a couple more laborers, it looks like. Or, now we got one more, because I think we're at five, so that's pretty cool. Working on these houses. Y'all about to have some neighbors. Yeah. There's one. Get to work on this house. Where you going? Come on. It's almost done. Yeah, cool. And it's done. Cool. And we can put y'all back to being laborers. Nope. Didn't mean to do that. What we got? And the child was born. That's pretty cool. And let's see. Oh wow! You've already wow. Uh, so this guy, this this crazy guy, has actually already reached the clothing limit. Uh, probably gonna no, not 150. Maybe like 75. There. Up to 75. You're taking your sweet time to get up to your your limit, so we'll, we'll let you do that. Man, this is a lot of deers over here. Deers? Is it deers? Or is it just deer? I don't know. But what I do know is there's a lot of resources over here. Uh, get this stone and this iron. And bring it to my storehouses, son. Yeah, we have seven laborers, so we should be able to do this fairly quickly. And I mean, I have a road leading right up to it, so they should be able to take it, come back down the road, and put it there. Uh, it'll take a little bit longer because whenever they're moving over. Uh, roads they move faster but whenever they're moving over actual terrain they move a little bit slower so that's just how their pathing works or whatever uh was I oh I was unable to do that that's sad um what could I put there anything of importance a well am I going to put a well there yeah uh, schoolhouse. Can schoolhouse go in now? Uh, hmm, what could go there? A woodcutter? Nope. Too large. Could a gatherer's hut go there? Nope. Uh, I guess I, I'm gonna put a well there. Right there. There we go. Put the four people that needs to build it. 
we have a well in this little section of our new town. Can I actually build a path over here? Because it looks like they, they like using this route. I'd like to help speed them up in whatever way it's possible. So the addition of these two houses has put our food back below 4,000, which, I mean, that's not really anything to be worried about right now. 4,000 food is, is still, or around 4,000 food is still a lot of food. So that's, that's still in pretty good shape. Uh, basically what I would want to do right now is try to look at getting our population up even further so that we can uh, start looking into actually uh, trading and stuff like that with, with uh, people. Oh, so they've both reached their limits, so I'll probably just let them uh, stay there and uh, produce as needed the, the materials that we that we need. So some deer, so that's pretty cool. Uh, let's see. I'm probably gonna make this entire area. A, uh, a neighborhood, so fill all this with houses eventually, uh, and of course use like over here as the trading area, probably storage along here. Uh, I don't know if I could do a road. Can I actually do a road around here? Yeah. Cool. Just want to make sure, because even though it seems flat through parts of this, like there could be like this right here you can see like a little bit of outline on the ridge and I doubt I, I could go up that right oh wow <laughs> it wants me to go all the way around there so I can't even go around here wait what that's really weird uh, yeah so it, it's kind of weird with the, the terrain but it's whatever we can we can work with it uh, okay, so they, they finally finished the whale. Hey, whale. Look nice with your little. What's that like? Cobblestoneish. Uh, area, whatever. Uh, main. I think the main use of the whale is when like a fire breaks out, they can they'll go to the whale and uh, get out water that's needed to put out the fires. So I guess, uh, in that sense, it's not that bad to put one in this residential area in case a fire does break out. Although, I don't know if that's a, called a disaster. If that label is a disaster, then I turn disasters off because I'm a pansy and do, do not want to lose my, uh, oh, did I build a road over here? Apparently I did build that road. Uh, actually, I can actually remove that. I uh, did not. I thought I right-clicked instead of left-clicked. Whatever. Uh, what was I talking about? I don't even know. But whatever. So we'll we'll have this area expanding uh, so we can expand our population and hopefully yeah these these guys have already got some children so they are helping expand the population as are these people well not y'all I need to have another kid come on I need more laborers uh, so that will probably do it for this episode we can pause the game. Hopefully you enjoyed. Uh, we didn't do a whole lot this episode. Some of this uh, series will probably have to be a little bit waiting for the people to actually uh, build up resources or do a little bit of planning. So 
Hopefully you enjoyed just a little bit of that. Uh, if you did, leave a like. Uh, if you want to see more, hit the subscribe button if you already aren't uh, uh, subscribed to the channel. And if you have any comments, leave them below, and I'll, I'll take a look at them. Uh, but after that, I hope you enjoyed, and I hope you have a nice day. See ya.